you ain't gotta be gangster to get some respect You gon' get what you get, that's a bet I ain't talking computers, but all of my shooters They really pull up with them tits My musical influences, I say Wayne. Shit, that's really it though, like, as far as influential. I posted a uh, freestyle on J Money, and it went, it ended up going crazy, really. Like, I had posted it to my original YouTube at first. He was like, nah, bro, take it down. Post it on mine, it's gonna do something. I did it, and it blew up. I did, like, probably an M in, like, five days, but I ain't never had that. It just, I don't know, it was going crazy. Social media was going crazy. I found my passion in music. As a young and like just listening to Wayne, listening to everybody really. I just liked how it sounded, how to play with the words, you know what I'm saying? Basically, it's like a, a vent session for me. Like, it's a way to express yourself. So, I fuck with it. Wild as hell. New generation hip hop, wild as fuck, man. Yeah, I had a show in Dallas. And before the show, we were shooting a music video, Free Mad Max. I was with Mad Max shooting a video to Robert. And, uh, Everybody left, we were smoking in there at first. Everybody had left though, like, it's over with. We've been smoking in there all day and we ain't supposed to be. So then when everybody leave, we go to sleep and then the laws come knock on the door and he trying to search the crib and everything, bro. We like, bro, you tripping, bro. You feel me? And then he ended up letting us go just cause of how we was making them feel. We making them feel bad. We like, nah, bro, you can't do this stuff. You feel me? He let us go though. And yeah, again, the rest is definitely a, a boost, like, depending on what you get arrested for, you will, it'll definitely boost your career, for sure. Is there ever a line that crosses out where it's not worth it? And what would that be? Ain't none of that shit worth it. I ain't gonna lie. Shit. <laughs> What's the first thing I bought? The car? The Porsche. Nah, he did a lot I of did, I just bought clothes and shit, but besides that. Before he thought about himself. Nah, I, yeah, I gave my mama, I gave my mama, I gave my mama her shit, and then, about her car. What'd you give her? Shit, I got a, she got a 2019 Infiniti. Aww. I gave her some money on the side then shit. I went and got me a Porsche, shit. Oh. I'm trying to be in everybody's face, on everybody's screen. That's the goal. I'm trying to get to the, where I'm a solidified artist in the game. Where my name rang bells, man. I'm talking about solidified, solid. It's different, like, when I come to LA, I always write. I don't know why it's like, but when I go back home, I can just go straight in there and just, it's just a vibe of LA make me wanna write. I don't even talk to nobody in the studio. I, you ain't even gonna hear me talk. I'm just gonna be writing the whole time. Then I'm gonna go in there and do my thing. I don't go through no bullshit really. Like everything's easy now. Like you get certain shit for free and all types of shit now. No cap. But shit, it's good and bad at the same time really cause motherfuckers gonna get around playing their role and shit. But yeah, that's how they go. I got two singles out, they just dropped, man, How I'm Living in Check, y'all gonna get up on that. Let that fuck the streets up real quick. And I got a surprise for y'all on the way, big feature shit, man. So y'all stay tuned with me.